Welcome back to another episode of Craft Track Tech Bites. And what we have with us here today is one of the most controversial products ever to enter the marketplace of digital motion picture. This is the Blackmagic Design camera. Why is it controversial? Because this thing came out, it's such a weird form factor. And it was like, a lot of people were like, who's gonna get this camera? It's got a 2.38 crop factor. It, uh, the resolution on it is, it, it, it's like, it's a 2.5K camera. It's a, mm, that's right. It's a, yeah. Like a 3K camera. So that's good, but it's not in the super class or whatever. And resolution, people put too much importance on it anyway. Uh, you know, like who's going to buy this? And also the price point is like it was really cheap. It's, it's I think, retails for 3000 bucks. right? That's right, yeah. $3,000 that comes with a, a copy of the DaVinci Resolve software for free, which is $1,000 normally. So it's too inexpensive to get mad at. It's too weird looking to love immediately. And the specs on it are kind of like, you know, what, you know, like kind of like this in-between phase. And then somebody went and started shooting with it and saw that the images were really fantastic. So now it's even more controversial because it's like, well, wait a minute, these guys maybe do know how to make a camera and um, <laughs> maybe they did a damn good job of it. It's definitely worth checking out and using before you judge it. Don't judge it on the specs which are also very good, but judge it on how you use it because, uh, and there's also another video which we'll put a link to with, who did the video again, the cinematographer? The, the oh, there's a number of cinematographers. There's uh, Marco Solaro did a comparison. That's the comparison, yeah. 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 There's a video of Marco Solaro did a comparison to the 5D Mark III and uh, it's really interesting to watch. It's not what you would expect. So I highly recommend you check that out. 13 stops of dynamic range on the camera also. Is that is real or like what we say? Real. No, it is. Yeah, a real, real 13 stop. Yeah. Yep. 13 stops of dynamic range. That's yeah. pretty much, it's the same thing as, as, a, as an, I ain't gonna get in trouble. It's the same thing as an epic. It's pretty close. <laughs> it's pretty dark. It's pretty much the same thing. It's a lot. So we have, it. so why don't you tell us more about it? Okay, uh, this is the EF mount. So yep. you can use any yep. Canon EF lens on here, ZE from Zeiss. And as you were saying, it shoots a 12-bit Cinema DNG file on here. You can also shoot ProRes DNX HD and you can it's it would be a 1080p file yeah and so and and so what would you uh where do you store the so it runs on the ssds can i can i actually yes you can you can pull oh, up let's the, just show yes, we're going to take our <laughs> hyper drive shuttle oh, that, there's one in here so oh there's, there's one, one there is yeah, one. we got <laughs> ssds all over the <laughs> place that. and this that's what's not even a kingston just a, a standard a... ssd so okay, we, i should say on our website under yep. support yep. we have the recommended ssds to use with this because right. we want the fast Right. SSDs. There's, 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 there's right, a whole right number of them now, and the prices are coming down, so it's it's been really good. Right. Using the SSD. So that shoots there. So it should, yeah. And does it also have a slew of outputs on it? It does. Want? So yeah, the the outputs on here, as you can see, Thunderbolt, which is unique. Oh yeah. Okay. So Thunderbolt it, output. It not only comes with the DaVinci Resolve software, but it does come with the Ultrascope software. So you could run Thunderbolt directly to your laptop. And look at your scopes. Let's, okay, so let's talk a little bit about yeah. the accessories. Accessories for, accessories for this camera are yeah. made by Red Rocks, Red Rocks. Zacuto, Revolution, Cinema Rentals. A wooden camera has some great stuff. Uh, View Factor. Um, let's see who else. I'm sure I'm missing some people. Uh, that's, fine. Yeah. that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. Big so just to be clear, you guys don't mind that at all. Like you, you're not no. you're not worried about cannibalizing. Oh, well, you should get our accessories or no. whatever. It's not like here's the chassis. It I looks would. like the front of a 57 Chevy <laughs> cross with the Starship Enterprise. That's right. And it makes good pictures and go right ahead. Right? The only thing we make are these handles that we hooked on here. Right. It's the only accessory besides the hood. You can, you can take it. It really does off. look a little bit more like off the next generation. Like I'm expecting at any point for the, like the front of it to like, you know, like expand and then the back of it <laughs> yeah. to slam into a uh, warp 10 when the flash of like bang. Dun. Exactly. Da, 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 da. It looks good when it's all rigged up. The black magic design camera is the model name of this. Cinema camera, Black the, Magic Cinema the, Camera. Yeah. The Black Magic Design Ultra High Propulsion Warp <laughs> Cinema Camera. Awesome product. Thank you so much. Craft Truck Tech.